this side. Good? doing today is actually very simple we are going to just we're just gonna do some lawn work uh, mow the grass use the weed whackers we're gonna power wash the driveway uh, and yeah we're just gonna go from there and see what uh, see how this goes so uh, as you can see I used a six amp the six amp hour battery and a four amp hour battery in here there wasn't really that much of a difference. You know, I'm pretty sure if there was two 6 amp hours, there would be, but, uh, yeah, there wasn't really that much of a diff difference between two 4 amp hours and one 6 amp hour and a 4 amp hour there. So, yeah, I was, you're able to do it, which is awesome. So, it helped me out. It helped me out, because I only have three of these at the house right now, so I had to use one of these. Well, you need to cool your batteries off quick. Wow, that actually did the trick. That's not even that's not even warm anymore. It's been on there for like, let's say, four minutes. It's not bad. Yeah, those aren't even cool, hot anymore. Not even warm. Awesome. That cool. That cools your batteries off really quick. Now, we are going to talk about this in this episode today on how and what these are really for. Yeah, but for now, I am just going to go back to the traditional cable. Oh, oh that's good. It goes on one way. It goes on one way. Very good. Yes, yeah, so we're going to use this. Perfect. And I got one down there. On this channel, we do not kill life. So we are going to... I'm going to relocate those uh, frogs really quick. Alright, now that the three... Uh, now that the three frogs that we found are relocated towards the creek, we are going to continue with uh, weed whacking.
important. Find out if I'm in or not. I hope I didn't dust myself. So today, uh, we did a lot of work. My wife was digging up a lot of stuff. Uh, we do, I was weed whacking. We, uh, I power washed the driveway. I'll actually show you guys that in a minute. Uh, and I, uh, we washed the two. We washed both of the cars. So, but when it comes to this little device, now this, uh, I use this along the side of the house once. You know what you guys just saw in the video. And it pretty much diminished this. This, it's not useless yet. There's still a little bit of, a little bit of action in here. But I do not know exactly what this is for. This is definitely not a long-term solution uh, compared to the Weed Whacker String. So because this is cheaper, it, it'll last longer and it'll refresh itself. But this, $14 for two of them. Uh, I think this is probably used for if you're in a situation to where it needs to be. It's a, it's a high, uh, a condensed area of plants, grass, and and whatever. And then you need this in that uh, specific spot. Uh, I think that's what this is used for. Uh, this is not, I don't think this is a regular use just to do your edging along your fence, uh, along brick, along your uh, your driveway. I don't, yeah, so this thing, uh, this has a couple more uses out of it, but that's pretty much it. I don't see this being the long-term solution to replace the, the string. That's that, but I'll show you guys the driveway really quick. It only took a little bit, but as you can see, like an out of all this stuff, I got all the dirt out of everywhere. I got major dirt off of there. Uh, I'm still working on that. It's getting there. Uh, power wash the boat a little bit more. But yeah, as you see, I saw a puddle right here. But yeah, this was this was all dirt. It was all dirt, and uh, I got the most of the dirt out, so which is good. 
which is really good. It looks a lot better because I got tired of all the loose rocks just uh, getting lodged into the into my shoe. But as you can see, part of the driveway got lifted up. So yeah, I'm not going to mess with that too much because yeah, it's a weak driveway. We need it replaced. But I got like all oh, it's good. It's good. I like it a lot better. This foam uh, blaster is awesome. I love it. It does the job really, really well when it comes to uh, spraying detergent or soap on your car. Uh, it's pretty pricey for what it is, just for an attachment. But all you have to do is buy it once and then not break it. Then it, it'll last you forever. But yeah, uh, today was a successful day. No one got hurt. Uh, I used the crap out of my 16-inch uh, OnePlus lawnmower. It'll, it's, I love that lawnmower. But, uh, but yeah, I'm actually using more batteries that now than I did before because I'm going slower. So yes, uh, that's pretty much it for this episode. I hope you get a, a feel for it. That weed whacker is, it does the job. That weed whacker does a really good job. And it's the correct height for me to, uh, to use it for a while. The cheaper one, uh, the Easy Edge Ryobi uh, weed whacker is a bit too small for me. It's too short. I have to hunch over to, to use it. But that one does the trick. I got to clean it. I got crap all over there from power washing. So, and that is it. This is David Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in, and I'll see you guys next time.